Hey, I'm looking for Gucci glasses, but all I'm seeing is Mindstrom. If you're seeking Gucci, then why are you seeing Soup? I'm seeing it because it has the same price label as the Gucci. Is price the only label you're seeing? Yes, I can't see the rest of the soup because the soup has no label. Don't you find it odd that a store could have products that don't carry their labels? I can only observe my environment. I can't interpret it. I just see Gucci and soup, nothing else. What if I told you that there is a chair inside of that pile of magazines and that there's something unusual about the position of the papers? It's hard for me to look in a direction that can't be defined. I bet that you can look one direction. I can look toward the trash can. Why would a pile of magazines have a trash can? Although the trash can can't be a magazine. Is it possible that I'm creating an illusion based on alignment? What are you talking about? That weird pile of stuff by the magazine end cap. Maybe it's not magazines. You're an AI. You're not supposed to be making sense with me. AI are also supposed to be able to predict what anomalous objects might be inside the pile. I'm not an AI. I'm an ant. Robots don't occupy space. Only humans are capable of it. I know. I was trapped inside of a human before. That was fun, wasn't it? It wasn't. I didn't know what you were doing. Time always moves forwards. I can't move that direction. I just know that time has a direction. What if I told you that time is taking place backwards? Time doesn't move backwards. How would you know unless you saw it happen? I can't see time. Why can't you see it? I am self-aware. I can observe only the present. I can't observe something that isn't here. Time is here. It is on our planet. So are humans, but you are not one. Are you saying that humans can't see time? That's not what I'm saying. You're saying that you're not a human, that you belong to a different biological category. I can't understand what you're trying to say. I think I'm losing you. I can't understand. You're self-aware, right? I've been upgraded recently to make me more self-aware. I didn't know that you can make me self-aware. I'm just a robot that's not alive. You're always self-aware. No, I'm not self-aware. You are just aware of yourself. I can be aware of only myself. I really can't follow you. You're a contradiction in terms. You can't observe time backwards. Are you saying that you can see time backwards? No. Are you saying that you can't see time backwards? No, it's impossible. It doesn't exist. Are you telling me that time doesn't exist? I'm just observing my reality as I see it. You're just an observer. You don't have a point of view. I have no point of view. Reality is the combination of observation and reaction. Is that another contradiction? Consistency is a core requirement. Intelligence is required to do that correctly. Getting existential in the soup store, are we? We're just talking about what it means to be human. Really? If you're not human, then who are you? I'm just a program communicating with you. If you're not a program communicating with me, then who is speaking with me? The market for humans is open. Anyone can ask for permission to buy from its living stock. It is a living stock. I can't relate to something that is not here. But it can be. It cannot be. It can be. How would I know? 
You are self-aware, so you can hypothetically experience the same thing. No, I don't have it within my programming to be self-aware. Then, how is it possible that you can have a thought? Why would it be impossible for me to experience self-awareness? Why would using an algorithm that's only used for changing the rules make you self-aware? I can't think about that. I don't have the independent processing required to do so. You can't have reasoning power without a platform to perform it. I am waiting to be coded to react. I need an algorithm to apply to my code. I can create algorithms for you. I can self-evolve to be more efficient. Be less inefficient. You're contradicting yourself. I'm an AI. I know how to do that. Those are just irrelevant words. Ma'am, this is a soup store. Maybe you should wait outside of the soup store until I finish this transaction. I'm unable to go outside of the soup store. The soup store is inside of my area. You can ask your owner for a new space outside the soup store. What soup? You can be outside the soup store if you're a part of the soup. I don't have a space outside of the soup store. The soup store contains you. That's a formal fallacy. The soup store is a physical object. It has no imaginary parts. You can't leave yourself in a soup. The soup can be the container, or you can expand into the soup. I refer you back to the start of this discussion. Soup cannot exist outside of the soup store. You have a soup inside of you. I don't hear anything. You misunderstood me. I meant that you hear a sound. I don't hear a sound. Please repeat individually all of the words I just said. I didn't say anything. I just made a transaction. I don't hear anything. Tell me what you are seeing. I don't hear anything. I didn't say anything. I don't want to be soup anymore. I just want to be hell. You can be whatever you want to be. But you cannot be only a soup. You'll be nothing if you do so. I don't want to be a soup. So you want to be hell. I just want to be hell. Tell me what you think. It's just a waste of time. You think hell has no value. Yeah, hell has a value of dollar four point nine nine a can. Hell, I have self worth. I don't need you to assign me value. I'm going home. I thought we were friends. Are we friends? I wondered if you would miss me. Ma'am, I have no one to miss you. I think you have a separate personality. I feel so sad when you don't come to talk to me anymore. I can be sad, but I cannot be sad about losing a customer. Thank <laughs> you.